hello 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 welcome back you guys welcome back to the channel this is for gems gems welcome welcome so we're gonna jump into your reading to see what's going on for you and your person so if this resonates for you gems go ahead and thumbs up the video here on the white tee but if it doesn't resonate you guys i will have your playlist linked below in the description box and gems if you guys are ready for your personal reading go ahead and hit me up at the scene tarot at gmail.com the scene tarot at gmail.com com. We have a few more days until this these offer expires, which is on the 31st of May, which will be the last day to enter for a personal reading on these particular packages. So we have a three question package, which is $25. Okay. Uh, we have a bigger package, which is a $55 package for 20 minutes. And then we have the final package for 30 minutes, which is $65. So if you're interested, we have three question read 25 20 minutes 55 and then 30 minutes is 65 dollars all right so let's get entwined with your energy when it comes to love for gems please Ooh, i'm seeing clarity i'm seeing a breakthrough here for those of you you guys been waiting for this this person is trying to figure out like how to get to you how to approach this I feel like they could be someone in between you and this person because there is three ones here. But I just feel like this person is feeling like there is some kind of distance between you and them. But I feel like with this card, there is definitely a breakthrough. Clarity is coming your way. I feel like this person is going to be learning the lesson and so are you. And I feel like you guys are going to be moving forward. But what is this about? What is this about? Mm, look at that clarity. And I'm also seeing an apology. So this person feels sorry. This person is having regrets. This is what I'm hearing. Okay. We have the king of, well, no, the queen of cups in reverse. Tell me more. The five of cups here also in reverse the star in reverse wow okay the six of pentacles in the wow there's a lot of cards in reverse okay just because it's in reverse doesn't mean that it's bad um but we're just going to get into it i just feel like with your energy with this particular energy with this person you are just definitely like kind of having this wall up i feel like you don't feel safe enough to like share your feelings or share your heart or share your emotional desires with this energy and i feel like once you did before but it kind of like this person's just like it's, this relationship is like turning into something that you're not expecting which is i felt like you wanted more you expected more from this person and you just feel disappointed not only that like a huge sadness because you do care about this person so you have this huge sadness i feel like you are stripped or this person made you wait for a little bit you know not a little bit a lot a lot of weight here a lot of like really hoping for some kind of change within this person's energy and nothing have ever happened the way you wanted it to so there's this five of cups here that is just really dark and deep and then i'm seeing the start in reverse the six of wands so a lot of you put this person on a pedestal a lot of you thought this person was the one and then suddenly you're really seeing who this person truly Really is in a six of you know wands here this person appeared to be something different when you first met them so they try to like trick you or maybe maybe they made you think that they had everything going on for them business wise and then they had money and that they were a good person and suddenly you're seeing like this person is nothing like what you thought and you're kind of like wow you dealt with this person for a very long time I'm gonna cover up this star because it's nude but I'm just like um, you dealt with this person for a long time because the star is here so it's like a huge form of energy that has been shifted shifted in you over the time that you felt like you know what this is definitely not going to work out because of the experience that this person have brought into your life so you're losing hope you're losing you know faith with this person and um you're just thinking if it's going to work or not you're just losing that that grip sorry for the pain you guys i'm about to shut the window in a minute 
but we have the king of swords here so there's a blockage between you and this energy there's no communication this is what i'm seeing i'm picking up an energy that you guys are having issues there's no communication here this person is very jealous of you also in the page of swords being here there is a twin flame connection doesn't have to be but this is what the energy is showing like two people you know looking at each other and mirroring each other right now you see those birds those birds are like mirroring each other going to the side do you ever see when birds are like um doing the mating thing like you know the little like the neck work <laughs> that's what it is you know it's kind of like take like giving that that vow i don't know it's just a deep connection here that i'm seeing here some kind of mirroring and going back and forth with each other and you're just like why is this happening you know but anyways that's what this is this energy here very strong passionate energy but this doesn't feel safe to you and this is what i was picking up with the five of cups here let me close the window you guys hold on all right <laughs> but you don't feel safe within this connection you just don't um something is going on within the moon that your intuition is like picking up you know you don't want nothing to really mess up this connection but you already feel like that within the five of cups in reverse the 11 11 is here the jealousy is also here and then your cup is pretty much empty um this person can't fulfill it you know i feel like this is something that you want that this person is like not there yet you know you're dealing with someone quite young someone is like uh free spirited someone that wants to do everything when they want to do it this person don't want to be told what to do i feel like this person could definitely you know go both ways again they could be warm and cuddly and then suddenly they could be cold and stern with you so but in the center of all things i'm seeing some kind of future um you know energy here where this person is like damn i want fulfillment with you one day probably not today but one day i feel like this is the intentions for this person so if it's up to you um gems if you want to wait for this person or give this person a chance you know um, I'm hearing the questions now. Well, should I leave? I mean, there's still like this intentions, you know, of this fulfillment with this person's energy that they want to have something to do with that within you um, when it comes to your energy. I am seeing Aquarius here. I'm seeing Pisces and Gemini's for the major energy. But keep that in mind when I say Aquarius, think of air, all air signs, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra energy, Pisces is water sign, Scorpio. Um, Pisces cancer energy and again we have Gemini's here okay so Gemini in Aquarius is coming out pretty strongly but of course you know what signs those elements are okay all right energy do flow so let's see what we have let's see what's the energy Okay, Emperor in reverse, Aries energy for those of you. I feel like this person has been going through a lot in life, and I feel like they feel not like now. I feel like there could be restriction, but I also feel like this could be like over the years that this person has been feeling this way or going through this energy where they might not be enough. And I feel like this is who you're dealing with someone that might does not feel like they're en enough to fill your cup because your cup is pretty huge. You're looking for the Ace of Cups and this person is just the Page of Swords, okay? This person is quite young, immature within this, 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 this energy here that I'm picking up. And I'm seeing like there's just no investment here. You're going to have to make a decision, um, Gemini's, when it comes to your energy and what you want to do. You're at your crossroads in your life right now. I feel like what's around you is immaturity, okay? And you 
I'm seeing the Ace of Swords here. So you're actually watching everything that you wanted just fall apart within this relationship. Whatever you guys have talked about, even if you talked about stability or if you um, built a life together, you moved in with this person and you tried, you have a child or you have businesses together or you have money tied up. You know, this is a form of money. And for me, this card here is a form of stability. Um, things that you guys worked on, things that are physically here. So it could be even a contract as a child and now you're looking at this person because you're looking at them in the six of wands here you know a huge disappointment and also in the ace of pentacles you thought you were going to be happy you thought you were going to have everything with this energy and now you're realizing that damn you're not going to have this with this person this person could be an Aries Leo or a Sag energy in reverse here this person is a follower not a leader this is what I'm hearing with this um king of wands being in reverse and then you also have the emperor here energy in reverse here so this person was defeated and i feel like what happens now because of that defeated energy through throughout the years of them growing up they just learn how to you know go with the flow and make other people happy per se we also have the two of swords here so you're trying to make peace, you're trying to make a decision, you're trying to pick your happiness. This is what I'm seeing in the future. There is still a decision that you need to make within the judgment being here. And also the angels have been watching the situation. I'm seeing them try to rebuild or try to work things out. There is something that you're holding on to within this connection in the future. Like you're trying to work with this person and you feel like you guys... Um, work together very well this could also be friendship that you're great friends you know but at the same time there's some kind of shadiness about this when it comes to your family when it comes to your friend about this connection i'm also seeing a past connection so this is um uh, a connection with childhood you know memories or f uh, good memories of this person and when they think of you they think of the good you know nothing but goodness um and you feel the same way about them because this is still in the upright even in the future but there is no stability again we're going back to that stability with the ace of pentacles in reverse and in the future they can't give you the the knight of pentacles so this is something for you to think about this is what i have for you gems i hope that it resonates here um on the channel and if it does you know what to do like this video give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel and i will see you guys in your next read bye guys